Hey guys, Boz here. I want to show you two things today. One is to how to install Optifine and the second is how to install shaders that work with Optifine. This used to be a pretty complex process before, but here's a quick look at standard Minecraft. Uh, you know, this is just generic vanilla Minecraft, uh, faithful texture pack, and it looks okay, you know, and you're maybe happy with it, but maybe you've got the extra computing power and you want to really enhance it. You don't want it to look like this, but you want it to look like this. Now, this is definitely doable if your computer's got the power. If not, you may want to skip the shader part, but this also, this video shows you how to install Optifine. And Optifine is very good at optimizing your system on slower PCs. So let's take a look at how to do that. So we're going to go to the Optifine website, and here it is here. And all the description of the video has all these links. We're going to scroll down here, and we're going to get the Optifine G7 Ultra for 1.88. This is the latest version as of this video. There might be newer versions depending on when you see this. So we're going to go ahead and click the uh, link here. Uh, you're going to see a lot of ads on all these websites. Um, you know, I apologize for that. I'm going to clear them so you don't see them on my video. But you're going to click right there in the center where it says Download Optifine. You can see it downloaded. We're good to go. Now we're going to go to um, the uh, Shader Pack. And this is the one I recommend. And you can pretty much ignore everything on here on how to install like these mods to let you install shaders because Optifine does it for us. So we're going to grab the SUSE uh, 10.1 standard. You can try some of these other ones if you've got beefier computers. Um, you go to these websites, a lot of ads come up. You got to be very careful. These websites like to make, fake it and make you click their ads. Don't do it. You want to click on skip ad eventually up the top there. Here's the link to it. Click on that. You've received, accept their terms, hit download. Boom, you've got them. Now, it used to be installing Optifine was kind of a pain. Now, all you got to do is just launch the jar. I click it. It comes up. You hit install. Boom, you're done. That's it. So we've downloaded the shader pack, but we have to install that too. And that's pretty easy to do. And I'll show you a method that I find to be the simplest for this, because you need to know where your Minecraft folders are. Is just go ahead and launch your Minecraft. And you can see here now, the Optifine has already been installed and selected. And you can see my old profile. Uh, but Optifine is installed. I'm gonna hit play. And then boom, we're gonna be coming up in here into uh, Minecraft with Optifine loaded. Now we'll full screen this here so you can see it a little bit better in a second. Uh, but you can see there's a lot more settings now with Optifine. But that shader one here is the important one. And you can see we already have this uh, shader pack installed. But if you click the button right there where it says open shader folder, it takes you right where you need to take it. Now we're going to delete that shader pack. Um, and then you can, we're going to go with the back button which took us back to our download folder. We're going to go ahead and cut this. And we're going to hit back again and we're going to hit paste. And boom, we've just put the shader in here. Now, just so you can see the difference, we'll go full screen here. And we're gonna go into single player world here. It's just a generic world. And we're gonna look around here. This is vanilla Minecraft, standard with the faithful texture pack. But we're gonna hit shaders. We're gonna select this shader that we just installed. And we're gonna hit done and done and done. Back to the game and here we are. It's looking beautiful. Now, there's a lot of settings in Optifine you can play with. Uh, you can dip, you can disable certain things. Uh, you can increase the detail levels. Uh, you can see there's so many options in here. Uh, but we're gonna not worry about that right now. But if you click in shaders, you can see some other ones here. You can turn some of these things off or on or increase the levels of them, depending on if your computer can handle it or not. But you don't have to. Um, but anyway, I mean, here you go. Shader packs, Optifine, very easy to install. Hope you enjoy it, hope you had fun. And uh, in the description of the video, all the links to everything you need. Enjoy your new world.